big blue ceramic jug. I'm not so keen on that handle though. Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Pup. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hi, welcome to another of the Hawaiian Shirt Papa tours. This time it's of the R&T Auctions. They have a storefront. This is where they used to have all their uh, auctions in, in a live performance. And then it became the pickup point for all their online auctions. But now they've moved the majority of their online auction pickups to a warehouse area in in Niagara Falls. Uh, these are the items that they have chosen not to place into auction. Um, and some of the place does, this location also does have um, furniture that is to be picked up by folks for the online auction as well, but not, not too many of them. You'll notice that they only have a lot number on them. Unlike this one, for example, as a price on their tag by now. It's, they've got in, new items, almost new items, vintage, antique. Um, you really won't know what you, you're going to come into when you walk into this location. On their online, you can, you can see what they have. They, they're actually quite good at doing their description. No one's going to be perfect because no one can know enough about everything to be that accurate. So they get a, a give of a, a good description and you make your decision based on that and your experience with them in the past. So here we are, we're just looking around. <clears throat> This, I, I think this was teak, but I, don't hold me to that one for sure, because it may just have that kind of a look. No, it's not. I don't think it's teak after all. It's, but it's a whole set is available there. There are a few things that they aren't selling because they are online, number one. Number two, as they've also got some items that they have holding back for themselves as they plan to do some... Um, minor renovations, subdividing the space, for example. These doors are not for sale. I wish they they were, but they are going to make use of them for themselves. Those great chairs, there are auction numbers on those instead of prices. You can get a queen-sized queen four-poster bed there. A dressing table. They had more than one of the uh, bed bedroom sets. There's a vintage school desk. This is actually looking towards the street in this particular case, so it's backlit heavily. Um, there's a few stills you've seen of these already. There's maybe one or two more stills of that area. And even the carpets, I think, are part of items for sale. A couple of glass and wrought iron pieces. They've done small vignettes, which help do help you understand how how it feels and their proportions. And we're looking along the street side again, but I guess it clouded up a little bit. So, and the way we came at it 
doesn't backlight it so bad. Oh well, bad enough that you can't read the tags. Sorry about that. A fairly modern computer desk. These two chairs, stools. Lots of interesting things. Um, I know they're open Monday to Friday. I'm not sure about the Saturday part. Uh, you can contact them directly to confirm that part. They're on Victoria Street in, Vic in Niagara Falls. Um, not in the tourist district, but not far from it. They're just north of, of Highway 420, which goes into the Rainbow Bridge. Um, <clears throat> so you see prices on some of them which helps you make a decision if that's what you're looking for some people don't like to do the auction routine some people love the auction routine they've chosen certain items not to go into the auction it's an interesting side table it has a plant holder underneath and that is a jewelry chest right by the cashier it is for sale interesting locking me mechanism i hope you enjoy uh, you've enjoyed this one give us a thumbs up uh, a like uh, a subscription would be nice and maybe even a dingle of the bell so you know our next post as it goes up take care bye bye